Hey, YouTube. Happy Monday. Lord have mercy. Uh, Sean Bradley has then taken my title for this video. Because the only thing that came to mind when I was watching what I just watched was, well, damn. I started to put that in my title. <laughs> you know, after you've seen a good reading, <laughs> you got to say, well, God damn. <laughs> I could say, what? Well, oh, no, they might demonetize me. Sean Bradley, you stole my title. Well, damn. Did y'all see that shit with uh, uh, King Jive just put on y'all ass? Lord have mercy. Brother Jives, I'm making this video. Well, I'm making this video because I'm in the business of making videos. But uh, I want you to understand something. We are not all against you. I know it feels like this team up mentality that this whole so-called sector and now it's turned on you. I see it for exactly what it is. I do see it for exactly what it is. And I want you to understand something. This is called a sector. What makes this a sector? What sets it apart from everyone else? It's because they feed off each other. That's what it is. It's a feeding frenzy. Everybody in this sector, or sector, whether you want to call it that horrible name that that, that, that boy gave it or not, is beefing with each other. They all beef with each other. I include myself. So, I hate to say don't take it personally because it is very, very personal, but this is what they do here. Okay? They feed off each other. So, you're the big story. So, I saw your video. I saw that you have been seeing a lot of stuff. And I'm sure that it must be painful to think that I just answered the call went and spoke for a few minutes at somebody's uh, event and got to come back to like I am the devil himself. I understand that. Uh, so I, I want to say the videos, because he seems it seems like Jives does not want to be, he don't want a lot of videos made about him, right? Oh, mostly because they're all so negative and they're all trying to put him down and so forth. But that is not my reason. And the video that I originally made in saying that uh, he was off his game that day. That was not uh, because I felt like he was wrong about this event or I felt like he was a bad person or I felt like uh, he had done something wrong in this event. It's nothing like that. I just said, get some rest, you know. I didn't get to why I need to buy them things, but I haven't been following like that. Maybe people who have been following, it fit right in with the script. I don't know. But today, there's water under the bridge. I don't mean to offend but he did, I, I heard him when his, we watch a lot of this stuff, don't we? <laughs> Has anybody noticed that all you watch is this shit and the news? That that's it. I should cancel my, my Comcast. All right. So, Jives went today and addressed at the end of his video, live he just went off of, the people involved in this crucifixion of his. Like he has done some horrible thing. He's a horrible person. His, his, Crowns are trash and all this stuff. He made several good points. I didn't, I, 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 I was so elated. This is great television. I mean, listen, just like people got so excited about reality TV. Remember how everybody wanted to know what Nene said and all this kind of shit? What this one said and what that one said. It seems like we, now everybody knew what Candy said, right? And then they had another reality, uh, Real Housewives of this and Real Housewives of that and Real Housewives of this. And they just loved it, right? Well, for me, for many of us, I'm sure, this is the new reality TV, right? So I have to say, today, this was great theater. Now, I don't want nobody to get so mad that they go out and killing each other and so forth. But this was very entertaining. Now, you're all going to get numbers from this. Everybody wants to know, oh, who said that? Who said that? Oh, did she really say that? It goes back and forth. That's all this is about. It's just about creating drama. Stories for people to follow. Storylines, so forth, right? One exception. There's one group of people and one person in particular who I refuse to mention the name. The name that must not be spoken, at least on my channel. That name. And maybe the people who have been hit by that name will understand who I'm talking about. That was downright cruel, what that person did. 
They had no reason for it. No reason for it. It was downright cruel. And I'm going to say the word and I'm going to leave it alone. Crazy. It's crazy. It's psychotic. I don't want to invite that person into my life. That's all I'm going to say about it. That part is insane. But as Brother Shive said, just because you're crazy, that doesn't mean that you're the only one. <laughs> That's what I used to say. Motherfucker used to try to scare people on the street. They always talk about, oh, I'm crazy. I'm crazy. And so, you're not the only one crazy. Just like you can terrorize people, they can terrorize you. But no one wants to get involved with the crazy person. It just, it's just so futile. Anyway, did I see the whole live? No, I think I saw the last 30 minutes of it, though. Uh, I saw the, the part where he really started letting go. The part where he was saying that Jay Wilson had not done nothing to speak up for him after they were supposed to be such good buddies on this trip, after they thought they all had a great time, then he found that the people, when he got back, the very people he thought he had this great event with are the very ones that were stabbing him in the back. Or throwing, throwing gasoline on this fire. A fire for nothing. Listen, Jives. People saw you get paid. They got jealous. Why is he getting paid? So they had an attitude. Soon you got back, let's chop him up. Jealous. So whatever you got on that trip, I would say I would consider that earned. From the shit you got to put with these damn people, the shit you have to put up with, that was earned money. Wilson should have let you know what you were getting into, if he even knew. So, n Wilson is also toxic. I'm not referring to anyone else. I'm talking about Wilson. Wilson, you are toxic. Everything you touch turns to shit. Because there's such a disdain for you that anything connected to you will burn. And then the people who go and and go and participate with you, I see you're more than willing to throw them under the bus as well. He's starting to make little slide remarks and so forth. Five babies making slide remarks against this boy. I mean, what did he really do? I mean, he went there, the, 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 how long was the talk? A little talk for 20 minutes or something like that? Harmless, just tell him basically, sound like, a, sound like he was preaching to new people, really. But that's what he was hired there to come to do. That's what they arranged. So what did he do? That was so horrible. And even this, this video, this video where the names were mentioned, all he said was, you beautiful people, you beautiful people, you guys ain't got to argue. But what Jive doesn't seem to realize is that's all this sector is. This is what they become. Do not, oh. <laughs> this, is what it, this is why they call it the sector. I'm going to try to weasel my ass out of this. I try to concentrate on current events, right? But these people keep the pipeline so hot that you get easily distracted. So this is an addictive kind of a hobby. Is hobby the right word? Yeah, I think so. I think so. You tune in every day and see what's next, you know. But Jives, do not believe that you are out there on your own. I see this for what it, what it is. And it is unfair. It is wrong. And it's hard, very hard when people are hitting you so hard. I mean, that that other person, the name that can't be spoken, that was so cruel, so so unfair, so uncaring. It's psychotic. It pains me that you were exposed to all that. Don't lose your cool. Do not let these people drag you. They'll drag you further and further in. You know why? They're seeing you. Three videos, four videos, five. How many videos can I get out of this? Because there is no content. And when there is no content at all, see, you can always go back to doing church gossip and so forth. You know, T.S. Madison, she has her whole career in, in music and stuff like that. They just drop in every once in a while. People who have content. T uh, what, what is it? Uh, Funky Dineva. He does shows and things like that. People have content. They have other things they do. The people that you're dealing with right now have no content. So whatever the beef is, that is the content. And that is the, what's fucking us up. It's messing us up bad, people. Now, I'm not hating on you guys. 
it is fun. It is fun. It's like reality. It's like we are part of a reality show. So I understand. I understand. But I hate to see that brother drag like this for no reason at all, really. He hasn't done anything to anybody. Because a name was even mentioned. Someone saying that you're beautiful, that you pick out one one word and turn that into a beef. It's cruel and it's bad. And when I was saying that, What's that song? How did that song go? Don't push me cause I'm close. Wait, don't push me cause I'm close to the edge. Where that rap song go? When someone tells you this, that they think, oh, this guy, uh, Slim Mackey's losing it. That is not the time to go and pour on more manufactured drama and bullshit on that person. Stress them out even more than they already stressed out. See, it's the cruel part. They don't give a shit. Psych psychos, psychotic people. But Brother Jives, I'll give you this. You gave him some good television today. You decide. You gotta take charge of how much you wanna deal with this stuff. Cause they can go on for they can go on for months. They'll just keep throwing something in and throws up until they catch another victim. See when they catch another victim then it can all uh uh Terrorize that person and they'll get off you. But you can decide how far you want to go in. You gave him a good sharp read today. You decide how far you want to take it. But you, let you, I mean, you, let you make the decision. Not them. They're going to push and push and push and push. There was no reason for anybody going into your, your, your family like that. You know, they, they whine and they bitch and complain about people going into their families. And then what the fuck is, well, what was that all about? It's crazy. Crazy town. All right. That's what I got to say on this matter. All right, Jives, you are not alone. Some of us see it for just what it is.